Hey guys, this is Culture for 19 and so this tutorial video is going to be explaining how to use my very early version of my animation plugin. Now, yes, be aware that this is a very early build, and so it's probably going to be prone to glitches and breaking. So you need to use this with care, and it probably won't work yet, but this is kind of going to be explaining how it will work. Alright, so the download will be in the description. So once you have the plugin, it'll be right here. And so what you want to kind of want to do is search up a, a model called Animatron Figure, and you're gonna want to insert this guy. It'll kind of look like this. And so once you're ready, double click on this plugin, and then you'll start seeing this simple interface. So now click on a body part that you want to start animating, and press New key, and then you'll see all this axis stuff. The time property is important because it determines the order of the transitions. So basically, if you want the transition to start doing the next keyframe at like, say, 0 0.3, then it'll do that. But since this is our first keyframe, we're going to start at 0. And basically, you can just rotate the character's joints on the axis. And you, can you can't do this with the torso because it doesn't it isn't supported yet. Um, I'm just making an example animation here real quick. Okay. So now we have this pose, and so if you want to, like, continue on from this pose, press clone key, and then it will have the same pose on both keys, and then you can just edit from there and, like, reposition stuff. But it's important that you modify the keyframe time. The time, at least. Um, so let's just preview what we have so far. Oh, you have to click on the torso to preview. It's a pretty basic animation, but it's in a loop. So let's turn off the loop real quick and then just preview from there. Um, hmm. I guess that's just a glitch. What are you talking to? I'm doing a tutorial. Sorry, that's my brother. Okay, um... So let's just uh, keep screwing around here. I'm, s I'm not even going to be serious with this animation. I'm just going to fuck around with it. Um, blow them to pieces. <laughs> um, and his head's going to fly off and go in all kinds of directions. You guys will certainly do better animations with this. But yeah, there are infinite possibilities, but you can't move the torso, of course. So yeah, the download link will be in the description for you to experiment with, and good luck. Oh, one last thing I need to explain, sorry. Once you're uh, ready to upload your animation, you're going to click the Save Animation, and then just click New Animation, and then you'll notice that the properties that you have selected the keyframe sequence. You can make last minute changes if you need to. The priority property isn't very important. And then once you're ready, just publish it as a model. Um, my my uploading's a little broken right now, but hopefully it'll work for you. Set up. <laughs> um, so... Test animation, I guess. And then finish. And studio crashed. So, you may have to stop the game when you're uploading this, otherwise stuff is gonna break. But yeah. Hopefully uploading it will work for you guys, because it's not working for me yet. Anyways, so the, yeah, the download will be in the description, and thank you for